Point of care ultrasound or POCUS is a skill used by acute emergency and critical care clinicians to aid the rapid assessment of acutely sick patients and to allow early intervention in their care to ensure better outcomes. IDI has been involved in developing POCUS training, particularly around isolation wards, considering their use on patients with viral hemorrhagic fevers who may be in isolation for prolonged periods of time with well-recognised poor outcomes. This training has been developed for use with around COVID-19 and other respiratory conditions. A blended curricula has been formed so that using telemedicine based on an initial short didactic training, followed by an individualised training approach of image acquisition and feedback, has enabled us to provide training to a team of 16 individuals in Fort Portal, 14 of whom in total completed their training in the required timescale. The training sought to enable them to have confidence in identifying clear diagnoses, that thoracic point of care ultrasound could aid and to ensure that they had confidence to understand when point of care ultrasound would not aid them in reaching a diagnosis. It should be noted that skill acquisition varied by cadre of staff, but also in terms of the skill required to be obtained. So lung sliding, which enables a clinician to rule out pneumothorax at the point where the sliding was identified, was a very rapidly obtained skill by all members of the team. Through to being able to identify all the signs of consolidation, which took the team longer, between six and 10 weeks for most individuals. Now, it should be noticed that this training took place alongside their normal working day, and therefore the fact that they managed to achieve these outcomes within the timescales was highly commendable. Carrying out telemedicine training is challenging in many situations, but it was aided in this case by the fact that the ultrasound machines we were using provided us with real-time telemedicine image acquisition so that we could talk through different members of the team who were learning by seeing the images that they were seeing at the same time. This enabled us to build the confidence of our team so that 70% of the team at the end of training are still using their ultrasound skills in clinical practice regularly. It should be noted that there are many unanswered questions about POCUS and there is room for further research here in Uganda to aid us in identifying how best to use it in these sickest of patients.